King Von just dropped a new album called Grandson. Y'all go check that out. But he just dropped a new video called Don't Miss. He just this boosy badass. That just shocked the hell out of me. But we're going to talk about it after I show the clip. Then he this Webby kind of. And then he threw a shot at LPG Duck. And uh, from the grave, he's still rattling this shit up. But y'all check out this clip. We're going to talk about it. I'm at your death. You ain't even got no credit, little boosty and webby keep on here, savage. Damn, damn, what my man is sweat. New crib came with cameras. Duck got nail, no hammers. Fuck my off, nigga, excuse my crap. Said it before he passed away. He liked it 50 cent. Um, he looked up to a couple of other guys, but he never mentioned like the big time rappers, like current rappers. But let's just be real. Let's start with the last line first. With the hammer. LPG Duck, you know, Duck passed away a few months before King Von did. So King Von obviously made that song, you know, right before he passed, right after Duck passed. So with that said, uh, the second line, the Webby, I think he put Webby in there as collateral damage. He wanted you to know he said Bootsy. Bootsy, Webby, Webby, Bootsy. When you see Bootsy, you think of Webby. When you see Webby, you think of Bootsy. So, when he said Boosie has no credit, if y'all ain't from the streets, meaning Boosie have no credit, what he's saying? He's saying Boosie ain't sliding like he think he is. Boosie ain't got no bodies. Boosie ain't lit like him. Boosie ain't no killer. Boosie ain't got no credit. I mean, it's self-explanatory. So, then he said, and Webby, but him, he a savage. So, basically, Webby was collateral damage because he connected to Boosie. And then his name is Savage. He got Savage Life around his stomach. Got a song called Savage. He represent the Savage. He proud to be a Savage. But what King Von was trying to let him know that Boosie have no credit in the street. And Webby don't. And he's the real Savage. Then right after that, he said about FBG Duck, he basically taking credit for that. Remember when he was eating cereal on a DJ Academics uh, interview? And he be eating cereal on interviews and they just not finding out after that Trap Lil Ross or Trap Lil Ross, whatever that guy is, whoever that guy is, they just not finding out that uh, he was eating cereal, calling himself a cereal killer. Not only that, he has been documenting in Wikipedia as a cereal killer. He up there with Jeffrey Donner, Marilyn Manson, um, all those crazy ass motherfuckers. They got him up there as a cereal killer. So y'all quit uh, discrediting Von. Y'all go find a guy called Take a Pwn. And type in Take a Pwn on YouTube and type in King Von interview. Take a Pwn tell y'all exactly who the real King Von is. Even King Von Ops used to tell y'all King Von was on some shit. You hear what I'm trying to tell you? So he told y'all all y'all need to know y'all music. And I'm going to predict this. You know how Dirk sold 120 something K in a week sales? NBA Youngboy done less than 100 maybe. Lil Uzi, they thought he was going to do two something, but he ended up doing one something. I guarantee fucking teed you. The first week sales, and y'all, I want y'all to really give me my credit. His first, The day his album just dropped, the day is, the day is, damn, I got my phone upside down. The day is, July the 14th, I bet y'all by July the 25th, they're going to say he done sold over 220K, 200, good, clean over 200K, 200K first album sales, he's going to outsell everybody, had a number one chart on the, on the billboards, the only thing that can stop him from having a number one album all across the world, if Drake dropped. Lil Baby Mike can rattle something. Nobody else but Drake, I know for a fact, can outdo his numbers. Now, when Drake dropped a Search and Rescue album, All About My Dogs, whatever he gonna name it, when I tell you he gonna sell 300K his first week easily, I guarantee you that. But anyway, y'all like, comment, subscribe. I holla gang.
links are in the description. If you want to support, go get you a cup. Go get you a bag. For you can put a bag in a bag. How about this bag? Support. Links are in the description. What about a hoodie? What about a notepad? Support. Send me a picture. I post it on my IG. Support. Get a book. Get another book. I'm an entrepreneur. Support. Support. Many different options of merch. The links are below. They are in the description. They are below. They're easy to find. Support me. And I appreciate all the love and I support you back. Also, subscribe to my music channel. Like every video.